welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. Continue where we left off last time. Um, I think we've done the charms lesson and then the other little bits and bobs. Um, I think we're going to Hogsmeade now, I want to say. Yeah, we're going to Hogsmeade. So uh, we get to test out our uh, set and see if we can survive it. Done a few changes with the uh, settings as I did last time, and it seems to be running a bit smoother at the moment. The of this I think we should have a moon calf in charge. Fills our stout hearts with joy to be in the presence of such arrogance. Um, okay. Uh, where am I going? Over that way, isn't it? Fingers in it. I'm trying to see where it is instead of following the map at the bottom. <laughs> oh, main central area. I'd like to shop in the house. I generally cannot believe how big Hogwarts is. This is huge. <laughs> Revelio. Ah, fuck. I wonder what it was at the court. I wonder what animal I'd be if I was an animagus. Level 6, we can use that um, new outfit thing we got. Uh, not inventory gear. Uh, was that a new cloak? Yes. Dark art cloak. Uh, it's level 6 and 10 extra offense. Uh, okay. Definitely not going to look like a Hogwarts student at this rate. I'll leave my things on. Um, I can change the appearance so I still look like that, but with the Dark Arts cloak on. So uh, that will probably be the best, I guess. Uh, there's Sebastian. What is that? Rebellion. Three Sisters Bells. Three Sisters Bells are said to be the tribute to three similar, similarly named beautiful steep ridges that rise majestically over a glen in Argyleshire. It is rumoured that one can hear them ring in the glen, way across the highlands when they are rung in the castle. Locals have been baffled by the mysterious ringing for years. <laughs> now I have to take the room. My favourite room in the school is the library. It always smells of fresh parchment. Well, no one that fancy meeting Rebellion. 
Broken Broom. Broken Broom belongs to Celine Wartnerby. And is rumored to be all that remains after she insisted on demonstrating her experimental lunar apparition charm to fellow third years. Uh, to fellow third years. No one knows if she succeeded. She literally apparated herself to the moon. It's crazy. Uh, why does my screen look so washed out? very pale on that one. Maybe it's just my screen. Um, it's not in the actual game that I'm playing it on. My second monitor has it like that though. Oh well. Hello Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this hey. your first foray into the village? It is. It is. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavour to be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self-contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? Uh, we shall. Now we see my, whether my FPS can manage it. Slowly spawning in. <laughs> cool. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. Of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. I find the girls to be messier than trolls, truth be told. It's out of there, at the very top. I think rules against beasts in the dormitories should be enforced. Oh! <sighs> Pup scheme. Will your jumpers are a nightmare to get you in the trunk. Put your shoes on. Revelio! Mm, I don't see there's anything. Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, hey, given my detention pitch. record. Spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough to keep me well-rounded. Uh, sorry, Sebastian, I'm literally getting sidetracked by everything. Literally everything. Uh, it's got a floating quill. Speaking of detention, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. <laughs> Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Professor Weasley came to retrieve me, and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. Wow. How cool is that? Anyway. The entrance to Hogs Walk. So how did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section, and I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. Oh, way? just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. They're pretty to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. Oh, okay. I've got to check if they come up on the uh, map or not, the mini map. Uh, what's this one's over here? <laughs> I 
assuming I'm gonna need these. Uh, is that the Whomping Willow up there? I wonder. Oh, Run, it's it's from the Forbidden Forest. Look, what's going on? See for yourself. <gasps> Quite a sight, Hippogriff? isn't it? You certainly don't see that every day. Cool. Oh my God, this is so cool. Uh, hello, mushrooms. Uh, Toadstools, even. Uh, they're bees. He's already seen the hippogriffs. Rebellion. Why can we already name them too? So if I do Revelio, I think they glow whatever I can collect. So like down there's some more stuff. That's cool. I reckon there's a troll under there. I'm sorry if looking around a lot is uh... out of bounds to all students. Oh, hence the name. Forbidden. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. Ah, you can see Hogsmeade just past those ruins up ahead. Uh, yeah, sorry if I'm like looking around too much or anything uh, on the screen. Um, I'm hoping it's not juddering too much. Um, I'm just literally just trying to take everything in. It's just so much. So there's the Forbidden Forest, eh? Mm. Ooh, I see Hogsmeade, Hogsmeade up there. How big Hogwarts is? I didn't realise how big it was. Obviously, I knew it was going to be big, but I think it's that big. Is that the lake where they did the uh, Triwizard Cup, maybe? Uh, that over there is the bridge at the Hogsmeade Ex Hogwarts Express. Hog Hogwarts, e Hogwarts Express comes down. Uh, ooh. Have you had much of a chance to explore the castle? Best of course. A little? Hey. It's positively enormous. It is that. I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. Revelio. Loads to see. Places to discover. Oh? Any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? You uh, still ooh. haven't told me how you have been so good at dueling. <sighs> Let me go. <sighs> Levioso. Okay, I can't actually do anything with that apparently. Levioso. Oh, maybe I can. Levioso. Maybe not. On, uh, lock, lock targeting. Uh, trade wolf cape. Let's have a look at this. It's blue. The fence goes down one, but it's a superb piece. Ah, oh, cool. I kind of like that. It's got a trait as well on it or something. Um... 
I think I can. I, um, it says no trade supplies, and I'm guessing that I can put a trade on there. Oh, and it upgrades. You know what? I'm gonna wear that. And again, the other one does have the offence, extra offensive. Uh, we'll keep hold of that one though. Once we can get a trace on it, I think. Uh, what goes that way? I think we'll go proper exploring once uh, we've either got a broomstick or flying at least. Or, I've um... always thought Thestral's pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Ooh, that's a lake. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. Most notably that dragon attack. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. Revelio. <laughs> Anyway, good this looks. I'm hoping it is actually capturing it as well as um, I'm seeing it in the game. Going to harvest some knock grass from the greenhouse. Did you know that it's used in polygons? Uh, that was over that way. Oh. Oh, that's no, Hogsmeade. I thought it was a burnt down house then. Mr. Just, Moon! Uh... He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure! Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me! Eyes big as saucers! Okay. What did, Mr. Moon? Demi guys! Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you! Demi, guys. I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, but he's obviously had too much of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon in such a state. Well, that doesn't have to go Mr. and collect Moon it. Mr. Moon is quite the character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, she was. She's not well at the moment, but she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. Okay, Hogsmeade Station, Arranshire, Rockborough, Keenbridge, Lake, Historic Hogsmeade, Potion Supplies, Merchant Goods, No Trolls Allowed. Um, is that the Boar Head Inn? No Broomsticks. Uh, quality Butter Beer. Know what that bit on the bottom's for. Uh, Hogwarts School of Witchcraft Wizardry, Forbidden Forest. Uh, this area has been declared dangerous by the Ministry of Magic. Uh, beware of wolves, unicorn, caution centaurs, caution trolls. Okay. No vampires. Yeah, it's a good thing we're not a vampire then. Yes. Ladies. Uh -huh. 
honestly. Uh, if one could bottle the magic of this place. I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. That was a bit of a glitch there. Uh, what's that? Carrie Twins Cauldrons. Tomes and Scrolls. Specialist Bookshop. Some owls coming in. So I should drink. Hogs heads that way. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get, a wand and some other bits. Yes, Dittany seeds, some spell crafts and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with a new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. Awesome. Remember, oh, look, have ghost. fun. It's Hogsmeade. Hogsmeade Village is brimming with different sites, shops, and other points of interest that you can navigate using your field guides map. The Hogsmeade map shows shops and points of interest. You can track any of these highlighted by icon and pressing X. Wizard wear. Rumor pack. The old fool. Honey Dukes. Steepling Sands. Hogsmeade Square. Glad Rags Wizard wear. Madam Snelling's Tress Emporium. Three broomsticks. Zonko's John of the Choke Shop. JPP and Potions. The Hogshead. Ollivanders. That's definitely one place we need to go straight away. Uh, Spink Riches. Sporting Needs. Tomes and Scrolls. Okay. Uh, let's go get a wand. And then I think we'll just have a nosy around. We'll probably get some of these. Go check all, out all the different shops and stuff. Basically, have a bit of fun. Hopefully, anyway. Uh, Demi Guy statues. Field guide pages. Collection chests. Hogsmeade. There's five chests, 55 field guide pages, and nine Demi Guy statues. Okay. Right. Olivanders is here. The makers of fine ones since 382 BC. Your wand, oh wait. Blooming beard, not again. Who let them want to spin? There you go. Ah, uh, this is like the shot when uh, I went to. The actual place they filmed it. I bought my one. I'll be yeah. right with. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Or he knows me. Why does everyone uh, know me? Hello, sir. I'm looking for for a new wand. Yes, it's about time. Yes, I... about time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivander's, I'm sure. Finest one makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Hmm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes, yes, hmm, powerful core. Ten and a half inches? Hmm, you might do. Here, give this one a try. Oh, my FPS is tanking again. Well, go ahead, swish. Nope. 
Hmm. How odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Definitely not. Oh dear. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um. <laughs> we'll find you something, not to worry. Hmm. No, not you. Uh, uh, hmm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Oh, you say dragon. <laughs> Let's give this one a try. I'm trying to give me PTSD again. Oh, 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 oh goodness. Oh. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um... Do you like Star Wars where you just hold your hand down you? and see which one attracts to you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. A little box. I know it's not. Yes, I think you might be the one. Here, take it. I actually get to make my own one. How intriguing. Curious indeed. Ooh, which one should we go for? Oh, I go for the one that I curious indeed. Have. How intriguing. Curious indeed. How intriguing. Great range of magic, consistent magic. Powerful magic, yeah, we'll go for powerful. A dragon heartstring wand is most powerful and learns quickly. Uh, do these have any difference? Curious indeed. How intriguing. Curious indeed. Doesn't seem to change at all, does it?
you. 13 and a half inches long. I'm guessing it's going to be. Curious indeed. Uh, I'd say it's going to be on yielding. Phoenix feather, exceptionally rare, and a core with a strong sense of initiative. Uh, if you know Harry Potter, you might be knowing who, uh, what my wand was, and whose wand it actually is. Phoenix feather. You, thirteen and a half inches. Uh, I don't know about the flexibility of it. Intriguing. And I think I'll go for that one. Sure. What do you think? <laughs> Extraordinary. <laughs> Another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> ah. Now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sense a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Of course. And a phoenix feather core is terribly selective. This will be an excellent match indeed. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. I'll Ollivander. let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Uh, for those of you who do not know, I mean by that wand. Uh, I've got as close as I can, as far as I know of anyway, uh, to Voldemort's wand. that does anything anyway so I'm gonna leave that off nice so uh, let's get ooh, collections oh it's this wasn't it right map there you go right I'm there uh, if I go this way Actually, if I go this way around, and then come back, and then I can go up there. Or maybe I should go here, 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 and then come back over, do these ones. Yeah, let's go to the hogshead first. in my house. Uh, what's this poachers? Where is the ministry? Revelio. There's a few houses uh, with lock picks on them. Not with locks on them that I can pick. Chests in some of these houses and buildings. 
Right, the hog's head. <laughs> Rebellion. Stuff behind here, have we? Oh, I've got a hog's head. <laughs> Hello. Let me go. Akio. By looks of it. Uh, guess I've been there then. Uh, right, let's go and get some potions. powder network thing over there. Welcome to J. Pippin's Potions. I feel like I'm stealing from these people. <laughs> uh, potentially downstairs. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, You'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Oh, does that mean there's only slight limited time? What can I do for ones? you today? Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. Or come back another time oh, if you're in a rush today. Uh, I could sell some stuff. Wait, I have orange, I have new goggles. Golden dragon eyed spectacles. Wait, what? Do I? Oh my god, I do. Uh, that's eight. That's a nine, so they're going on. <laughs> okay, we can't leave them on. We'll change them to look like that. There we go. Uh, do we have anything else then? Where did we get them from? Oh, 
Oh, uh, potions and magical plants can be assigned to your tool wheel, L1. Tools can be crafted at potion stations and potting tables after purchasing potion recipes and seed packets in Hogsmeade. Tools can also be purchased from vendors. I might need to get some of them then. Very much, Parry Pippin. Very sp small Rebellion. J. Pippin's potions. J. Pippin potions, established in 1753, is a apothecary in Hogsmeade, where proprietor Parry Pippin sells a wide variety of potions and their ingredients. Say that five times fast. Let's see this mystical place over here. I just saw a page there. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, so we've been here, been here, been here. Uh, we'll go over here first, then up to here, and then back down. We'll obviously, all of these. Magic Neep. Well, hello there. Rebellion. Anything around here? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Ah. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way, and this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. <laughs> in addition Great. to seeds, I have plenty of plants. I grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. Feel like I'm gonna uh, be making a lot of money. Rebellion. The Magic Neep Cart. The cart belongs to Timothy Teasdale, who runs the Magic Neep. He enjoys being in the thick of things and engaging with customers outside the shop. Whoa, the size of them pumpkins. How do we get up to the next one? Get around. Yeah, follow this around and then to here and then up. There we go. So I just wonder if this is the pumpkin patch where um, Hagrid and that were hiding the Hippogriff. 
graveyard. Um, Revelio. Harry Potter, so I won't be surprised if we can. Oh, okay. I think I need to get stealth for that one. If I remember rightly. Money back. It's nice to just see like random people walking around in that. Oh man, we have some range on that, haven't we? Rebellion. The abandoned shop. The proprietor of this abandoned shop is said to have used a shrinking charm to aid in storing his inventory. However, a slight miscalculation ended up, for all intents and purposes, vanishing it. Lumos. Uh, what's that? Beside the house, maybe? Could be over there. Could be over here. Lumos. Oh, there it is. I got it. I wonder how far them things can be away. Oh. Or if there's a certain range they can be from it. Seven already. Nice. Rebellion. Yeah, I don't see anything out here. I don't want to go too far out right anyway, too early. A massive hole in the roof of that. Look at the size of the roof. Oh my god. That's huge. Assuming this is the barber shop. <laughs> uh, put on that one, that one, these three. Then we'll do the joke shop and the three broomsticks on the way out, I think. Here. Sienna Bloom Scarf. Ten offense goes up. Nice. Alright, we're getting offensive. Hello. Oh, come in! Come in! Welcome to Madam Snelling's Tress Emporium. <laughs> I'm sure I've no need to introduce myself. The 
used to call me Snelly. Oh, Snelly, why aren't you studying to be an aura? But I showed them. They're stuck in the dust at the ministry and I'm here thriving. Absolutely thriving. But look at you. Look at you. I can certainly see why you paid me a visit. Looking for a change, are we? Uh, no. I'm not sure what you mean, but I'm quite all right as I am. Some are going for that muggle with consumption sort of death becomes me allure. <laughs> but you won't find poisons here. No need for chloride of lime or ammonia when you have magic. Why don't you spend a moment choosing how you'd like to look? You can change your hair too if you'd like. Uh, what so services what do you offer? This be the what is it you might be again. interested in? Yeah, it's just character creation again. Okay. Uh, I'm out of here. Thank you, though. If you like a change, I will come back. Uh, I saw a flying buck around here somewhere. Revelio! Ah, there you are. Accio! Got ya. Find some money bag in there. I missed it. Oh, I see it now. Two bucks. Yeah, it's better than nothing. Is that wizard juggling? You might know what. Uh, right, where to next? Uh, let's go to the brood and peck. Beast supply shop stocked with the latest and greatest in beast byproducts. Nice. Oh, actually, I do glad rags first, and then I go around to there. Because that's only just here. Uh, what's this place? Revelio. Oh, this is it. Yeah. I know it's nice. Two shops in one. Okay. See what you can sell me. Uh, is he going to talk to me? Okay, he doesn't seem to want to talk to me. Um, okay, I guess we're going to the next one then. I should imagine you can't go wrong with some fizzing whispies. Scribbling chest. Rebellion. Uh, Prefect best uniform, okay. Uh, I'm betting it's an achievement to stroke all these cats, but uh, yeah, I'm not going to do that, I don't think. Not yet, anyway. Defense goes up, nice. on that one and we're good I right, want to go to here you can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented 
Oh, I know. That's cheating. As is that. Okay, right. Uh, next one. This one, that one, that one. These two, these three then. So we've got six more to go through. Oh, it's Honey Dukes. Rebellion. Sweet shop sells a variety of magical sweets from fizzing wispies to exploding bonbons. Customers would be wise to know precisely what effect they may experience before sampling the shop's wares. Oh hell yeah. Oh my god, it's like the place. Just randomly eating stuff as I'm going around. It's locked. Just take that from in front of you. Don't mind me. Dancing for uh, candy floss in the front. <laughs> Money? Okay, yeah, that's kind of cool. Not really much you can do in there, but it's kind of cool just to see it. Uh, Steepy and Sons. What's this one? Oh, it's this one here. Uh, cafe, maybe? like a cafe, doesn't it? Uh, oh, there's a bag there. 50 bucks in it. Nice. Can I go upstairs? Okay, it's all off. Oh, yes. Great adventure ensemble. Rebellion. school anymore to wait. <laughs>
Let's just look like we're still going to school. Oh, this is gonna be really weird. Uh, ooh, I see a page. Rebellion. The statue of Hufflepuff Hengist of Woodcraft, believed to be the founder of the village of Hogsmeade after being driven from his home by Muggle persecutors. Okay. over here. Right, where's the next one? Uh, Hogsmeade Square is where we already are. We've been into Glad Rags, so... Uh, let's go to the joke shop first, then the broomsticks, and then... Sporting needs. But we're going to do that next time, guys. Uh, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you want to see some more. And I hope, uh, look forward to the next episode. Because I am loving this game. Anyway, see you later, guys. Bye-bye.